So, today at Rappel's News, the MMO that just kept chugging along for the last decade or so, we gonna be discussing the Easter event that just started on the beginning of this month and will be going for a couple more weeks. This is your boy Russian, this is Rappel's News, and before we start the video, a sub to the channel would be amazing. And since you have your clickety mouse really close by, giving me a like and hitting that notifications bell would also be amazing. Alright guys, so I know this video should have come out about a week ago, and I really apologize, but I had a lot going on right now to do with looking for jobs and try to get some of my help things taken care of. So let's get started. And all right, so just to let you guys know, always remember I run those tests and I run the events mostly at the circus. And the reason for that is it is the dungeon that allows most people to be able to farm. So it would be really unfair for me to be running something like Devil Dawn where a lot of people cannot solo. All right, so let's take a look at my findings. First of all, um, the drops on this event have not been too bad. I was getting an average of nine faded eggshells per run, what is a lot more than I have been actually getting in the last events. Now, that said, always remember, you're going to need at least five eggshells of the same color to be able to actually get anything from it. So if you look in this way, you're really getting only two drops, mostly. But still, you got to remember, um, there are not too many mobs into the circus, so I will give it a pass. Nine is not that bad. Now, the one thing we have always to keep in mind is it doesn't matter if you get even a hundred. How are actually those drops when you open the eggs? Well, to be honest, they haven't been that bad. I was getting a lot of Godmother fairy bottles and altered pieces random boxes, and actually not as much of the milk and white chocolate eggs that, I'm sorry, it's only 10% of health and MP it gives you, and you can only have them for 14 days, so yeah, I wouldn't care about that so much. So yeah, pretty much the chances of getting something that is actually worth something, it's not that bad. I mean, I know most players and the most, if you solo a lot, Godmother Fairy Bottles is great. Uh, Altered Pieces Random Boxes, kind of not the greatest because it's on for 28 days. Um, I really don't know why they do that, but hey, can't complain. Um, Lucky Potions, always great. Energy of Fire, pretty good too. I'm just wondering why it's only Energy of Fire. Creature Resurrection Spellbook, awesome. But at the same time, I have like a few hundred of them since I don't usually use my pets as much. In about 50 eggs, um, I actually didn't got any special reward. So I really can't tell you guys um, how good the rewards are, okay? Got no Blast Power of Change, S Protection Card, Dark Caster Items, uh, Blast Power of Change Armor, or Ancient Cube. So probably very small percentage chance on that, but still, the other prices are not bad. Um, that's pretty much like the first actual event we had in a few months. Like we discussed before, uh, a lot of the events, uh, they don't really seem to be events. It's just something being thrown there. And I wish they didn't actually call events. There is one thing, and it's not a complaint that I felt was missing. And it's the Easter rings. Um, if you guys remember, it gives a plus 100 on every single one of your abilities. And I know if you're higher level, you probably don't use those, but... I feel those are great rings for people uh, to level. So kind of a missing opportunity in there. We also have the boss events going on. Uh, I apologize, but I did not have time to actually go around and look for them. So if I find any better information, I'll let you guys know as well. And I know one of the things you guys probably are wondering is because I was planning to actually do a video with myself speaking and I am not doing that today. And the main reason is I actually broke the clip for my lapel microphone. So I need to fix that. And I did not want to wait another day before I put this video out. 
So yeah, guys, that's what's going on. The world of repels. Now, I would love you guys to let me know in the comments what other type of videos you guys want me to actually make. I do need to let you guys know I do have a Microsoft Xbox account for my PC. So if you guys have interest to know if that's worth or not to actually have an account like this or what games they have available, they're worth playing. Just let me know in the comments. Also, again, don't forget to subscribe. It does help not just YouTube to know I exist, but also G Potato and the publishers, what may actually help for them to listen about your opinions. And since you're already there, don't forget to give me a like, hit that notifications bell. I hope you guys have a great week and happy hunting.